We're heading to Costa Rica. We've had an awesome time in Panama. The best taxi driver ever. Suitcase made the weight, but I didn't. Are you a chunky monkey? I'm a chunky monkey. C.S. Lewis said, You're never too old to set another goal or dream a new dream. We're John and Bev, and after a lifetime of hard work, our retirement goal is to travel the world and finish our lives with many memories we've made along the way. We are the retirement travelers. <laughs> Join us for season three as we travel the world, starting in Central America. These are my only skills. <laughs> it's a really nice car. SUV, hopefully four wheel drive. Costa Rica is Spanish for big potholes. Don't always believe everything I say, but there is some wisdom. 400 feet at the roundabout, take the second exit and stay on radial El Coyol. We are in the rental car and we have paid for a ferry a ticket. I could not read any of it, but I hope that I did write it. I got a receipt, so that's good. Going, I tried we're, we're my best. We're going somewhere. <laughs> we're going somewhere. Oh, that was kind of crazy. We did not change money when we got to the airport. We should have come in with some cash. Yeah. So we'll have to stop at a bank somewhere. Um, we're, we're supposed to be on the ferry at 1230. It's 1019, and I think we're less than an hour away from it. Yeah. Hopefully we'll be okay. So our six minute slowdown according to Google Maps, actually cost us like 30 minutes or more. Actually, we're still slowed down. So our, we had about an hour and 15 minute buffer time to be able to get on the ferry. And I think that's down to about 45 minutes now. So fingers crossed we make the ferry. Uh, the options of not making the ferry are not real good. Well, do you want to swim? It's 11 miles, so I'm I think my range of swimming is more like eight or nine, so I think 11 is oh, 11, right? yeah, 11 a little far. Yeah, and yeah, carrying yeah. the luggage and everything. It would yeah, be, it would be, and, and me too. <laughs> and you, it would be difficult. <laughs> it would be really hard. This is known as the sloth uh, highway because <laughs> the sloths just pass us by because uh, we're going well. We're moving now at about one mile an hour, and that's the best we've done. Only driver in the car. Only, Only driver. driver. Okay. Ahorita. El momento de ingresar al ferry, solo uno. Okay. In like 20 minutes? Okay. Okay, babe, can you drive it on without me telling you how to do <laughs> it's it? It's going to be tough, but I think I can do it. <laughs> okay. I'm not, I'm not used to driving without, without help. <laughs> <laughs> they like you to be bumper to bumper here. Bumper to bumper. <laughs> Squeeze them in. Here I go, I'm getting out. Where, where are we going to rendezvous? How about the Lido deck? Hey, <laughs> this sounds like the love boat. <laughs> the love boat. Oh, that brings back memories. I took the ferry across the lake to the special port. The one that you and book the finest resort so I took some shots
Okay, so we, you think we have an hour left to drive? It says one hour and six minutes. Okay, maybe we'll find a fruit stand on the way on or a, a restaurant. A, on a windy road, but you know what? It's the adventure. It's the adventure. Put your hand in my hand, darling. Say go. Keep your eyes on the horizon. Stay go. All I need are your eyes. You're my arrow. Now we're ready. beach town where there's you know where you can surf surf and snorkel and um, hang out I've seen, we've seen a lot of cattle yeah and then Nicoya it's raised cows here they're all white so this white cows. this peninsula the Nicoya Peninsula is one of the blue zones in the world highest concentrations of people that live over a hundred so I'm I'm saying if we spend a week here that could possibly add five years to our life expectancy. <laughs> Maybe. That's that's our plan. So, and so if we go to every blue zone in the world, we, what will we, that do? We will live to a hundred. See, look, we're trying to get here. No, we got to go all the way back because we needed to cross the river. Okay, let's go back. Okay. Well, <laughs> we reached the end of the road. <laughs> yeah. It says, do not pass the river. Okay, we're not the only ones. We're not the only ones. But a guy came by with on a and, motorbike and told us to turn said, around. We didn't no, know he did the no sign, and then he said, turn around, and we ignored him, and we came a little bit further. And these people are also going the wrong way. Can't get through the river. <laughs> and here's someone else. Okay, we weren't the only ones. Yeah, at least three people tried. I guess they're all using Google. I think so. I guess we could have got some high speed and just tried to zip across the river. That's why you need a four wheel drive. Yeah, that would not have been wise. Okay, well, when it turned to dirt road, I kind of started to get worried. But Costa Rica is like this. Yes. There's a, there are a lot of dirt roads in Costa Rica. You just kind of have to know you're going to travel sometimes hours We're, on a dirt road. We are very capable of taking a one-hour drive and making it a three-hour adventure. Very <laughs> capable. We are so good at this. We are so, so good. Well, it's a pretty river. We didn't get to see it, but it was a pretty little river. Oh, okay, well. now we're going to go through the town. We were trying to say probably 20 minutes. It reminds me of the shortcut we took at the Grand Tetons. Yeah. We went on a gravel road. and I remember that. Poor little dogs are in the back seat just bouncing up and down. I know. I think we had three herniated discs. <laughs> <laughs> it was not good. <laughs> We seem to do this all the time, John. All right. It's been a while since you've driven. Well, see, I'm you not just needed to get. I'm not mentioning any names, but you're the navigator. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Shortcut number one was a fail. Okay, we're back on the road. A lot of one-lane bridges. 
let's try it again. Retake. Another shortcut. <laughs> Another shortcut. It okay. looks so good from the highway. It was paved okay. for at least 500 feet. Okay, shortcuts and Costa Rica may not go together. Oh, wait a minute. No, it's a river again. Another river. That one's not that big, but I still don't think we could get through it. What's the deal with this? Okay, we know something about Costa Rica. This is a good reason why you don't drive at night. You might just be going down a road and all of a sudden you're in the middle of a river. I'm glad it's not dark. We would have been in the river twice. <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, John's turning around. It's taking like 20 times. <laughs> it's a single lane road. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Okay, this has been an adventure. <laughs> Well, that's what we wanted was the adventure. It's all about the adventure. Uh, these are the same people. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. Turn around, turn around, turn around. Because I, I mean, that's, that, that could easily get stuck in that. Okay. But we passed this woman earlier. Yeah, we did. Okay, we're back on the highway. Back on the road. That one wasn't nearly as bad because it was short. Head west. Oh, Continue boy. for three quarters of a mile. Okay. okay. I think we were saving like no the, time the on main, that shortcut. The main roads are where you got to stay in Costa Rica. Yeah. Okay, we we just got in our gate. Yes, this is a cool little place. Be sure to hit subscribe and come along with us next week as we explore Montezuma.